Um, so, um, Jamie, uh, yes. what was a typical day like, like in Italy, what, when you were there? From right when I get up. Yeah, what time did you get up and what would you do? And um, when would you go to school and how did the whole day play out? Okay. Okay. So I would wake up at seven. I would um, turn my alarm off. I would get up, get dressed. I would go into the kitchen, have some cereal, and watch Mr. Bean. Um, what, what's Mr. Bean? It's this animated show about this silly guy who does everything wrong. Um, <laughs> like he messes up when he does everything, or he just doesn't know how to do it. I see. Um, okay. It's an Italian show, or no? It's an English show. Oh, okay. Right. Um, I would pack my book bag. Um, I would head out the door with my mom or my dad, yep. um, usually my dad. Mm -hmm. um, we would walk down the steep hill. Mm -hmm. and we we'll go over here. Okay. Yeah. You were at the camp. Oh, <laughs> I guess in this direction is fine. Okay. Um, and then I would get on the 17 bus for three stops, and then I'd say goodbye to my dad or my mom, and go to school. And first, um, we'd have some like five or ten minutes before classes to just do anything that we wanted. And so I would usually talk to my friends. Um, and then we'd go into the main corridor hallway on the uh, last floor of the building. Um, and we'd listen to a national anthem of some country. It would be huh. a different national anthem oh, each day. That's neat. Yeah. Um, and then I'd have classes. And then um, in the middle of the day, we'd have lunch. And, and what, like how many classes in the morning? What would be your schedule in a um, typical day? Well, there's usually um, maybe like six or seven classes before lunch. Yeah. Um, and then, like, and do science, you first you'd have a double period of science, uh -huh. then a double period of math, then, like, history, um, then English, then music or something mm -hmm. on a typical day. Then we'd have lunch, which would typically be, um, a roll, some yogurt, um, <laughs> some uh, pasta and trofie, which is like curly pasta, um, and fruit. Mm -hmm. um, they provide you lunch? Yeah, they pro there's a cafeteria. Oh, okay. Um, and then it's break time or recess, Yeah. what have you. And what do they do at recess? I would play... Um, basketball most of the time with Cesare. Mm -hmm. um, and then it would be afternoon classes, which would be music, gym, science, most of the same classes. Oh, so you'd have science twice in one day? Mainly, yeah. Oh. What kinds of things did you do in science class? Um, we'd learn about cells and organelles and stuff, hmm. and we had to make 3D models. Oh, what you what? Oh, of a cell or something? Mm -hmm, of a cell. Oh, um, and um, did you have to do any writing for school? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we had to write like three paragraph essays and stuff. Okay, what was one of the favorite essays that you wrote? Um, one of them I had to write about my favorite place and why oh. it was my favorite place, uh -huh. and I wrote about Star Island. Oh. And what did you say? Why was it your favorite place? Um, well, I like it because like, I've been coming here my whole life, and so it's sort of like a second home to me. Yeah. And um, that I love it because um, of the smells and the, the huh. people. Huh. What smells do you like the best? I like the ocean. I like the smell of the wood. Yeah. Like the oceanic and stuff. Yeah, yeah. Um, huh. yeah. Okay, and um, so, um, how, so, so you'd finish school around what time? 
around 3.15. Uh-huh. And then I, oh, let's see, what was it? How did you get back and forth to school? Did you walk or take a bus or what? Yeah, I would meet my parents at this um, gelateria, which is an ice cream parlor. Oh. Um, we'd have gelato, Ooh. ice cream. Every day? Mm-hmm. Oh, what a, what a great day. Yeah. Camera which is, in Italy, they eat ice cream with these tiny little spoons. Oh. And it's served in a cup, and oh. the spoons are really cute, and they kept a lot. Them. Terrific. Mm-hmm. Mm. So I'd uh, eat gelato with one of my parents. Then I'd come back on the 17 bus. Um, I'd get started on my homework. Uh-huh. Um, well, actually, before we came back up the hill, we'd get some focaccia. Oh, yeah. um, I would watch some Muppet episodes while I... <laughs> Um, ate the focaccia, uh-huh. and I get started on my homework. Yeah, then, yeah. Um, at around like eight thirty or nine, I check email on my computer. Huh. And then I'd go to bed at around ten or something. And did, were you emailing back and forth with your friends in the U.S.? Mm-hmm. Oh, that's great. I got a question. Okay. Have you ever gone to the ice cream parlor and your parents were right there? Mm, I don't think so. <laughs> um, That's a good question. <laughs> okay. Cameron's very interested in ice cream parlors because he <laughs> loves ice cream. Um, and um, so tell me about something, some day at school that was surprising or, or scary or interesting or funny, some, some day that was kind of dramatic. Okay. So I'll, I'll answer part of your question. Okay. Um, One of the scary days was um, on the first week of school. Uh um, I had no idea like where I was going because the building to me at the time was like huge. Yeah. And I didn't know where my classes were and I hadn't introduced myself to that many kids. Yeah. And so to get from class to class was like, oh, where's... 318, I have no idea. Right. Oh, I'll just follow this group. Oh, wait, no, that's not my group. <laughs> Whoops. And then I would just, like, stand in the hall until a grown-up came. Oh, that's a little scary, huh? So, one of the funny days was this, um, like, it was this whole week. It lasted a week. Um, one day was pajama day, and we, <laughs> we had to dress in our pajama or we could dress in our pajamas and huh. bring in like materials that we used to sleep with. Oh, and then stuffed, stuffed animals. Yeah, stuffed animals, oh. pillows, and stuff. Uh-huh. Um, and another day in that week was called um, like uh, work day, uh-huh. where you dress up like an employee of some sort. Oh, like like that you have a job. Yeah, and so. A lot of people like dressed in suits and stuff. What did you dress up as? Um, I forget. A juggler? No. <laughs> <laughs> Another day in the week was called Nerd Day, where we had to dress up like nerds. Oh. I wore like suspenders and big glasses. Oh, that's funny. And on pajama day, did you actually wear your pajamas to school? Oh. What what pajamas were they? Did you bring a stuff and stuffed animal? And what no, animal? I forgot my stuffed animal. Ah. Um. I wore these uh, pajamas that have like the whole earth on them. Oh. And like water in between. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Wasn't it funny to see everyone walking around school in their pajamas? Mm-hmm. Even, <laughs> the, even some of the teachers wore their pajamas. Really? <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> the teachers just as nervous. <laughs> Some. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like a fun school, other than the teachers being strict and yelling at kids. Yeah. It was fun in other ways. Yeah. Um, it's hard to believe that teachers that are nerds would yell at you. <laughs> um, so, um, what was, um, when, when you were in Italy, was, um, what did you think of the countryside and how did it compare with what you, where you lived in Philadelphia? Well, the, uh, the landscape of Italy is um, 
It's a lot nicer than Philadelphia here in, well, I mean, where I live in Philadelphia. Um, in Philly, it's just all like city. Yeah. Whereas in Italy, there's like ocean and trees and it's, it's a lot nicer and there's mountains and stuff. Yeah. Did you go to Venice? Not this, not this trip. <laughs> um, yeah, and um, let's see. So, um, so you, it, it was beautiful. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, did you have a car there, or did you just ride public no, transportation? Yeah, I just did public transportation. Mainly buses or trains, or yeah, yeah. and uh, Sefton. They have a subway there. Sub yes, that's what. It's oh, what did you call it? Well, I was calling it what um, we call the buses in Philly. Oh, oh, Septa, gotcha. Okay. All right. They're not called Septas in Italy. Right. Um, okay, it's this one. 